I'm Jared, and I'm here to do a review on the Xbox 360 Kinect. And the review is the fact that, well, when it was called Project Natal, it seemed like it was going to be such a good item. The fact that you'd be able to do several different things with it. But now that it's out, it's a piece of crap. It works good. It's kind of fun. But there's no good games or there's just nothing you can do on it. So, I am reboxing my Kinect and going to sell it. I was thinking at first about selling it for $100. Eh, I was probably going to sell it for 90 now or something. But I'm going to get rid of it because it's just gathering dust. Ex uh, GameStop only wants $40 cash and $60 with the power rewards card and that's kind of a ripoff considering the fact you pay over $150 for it and including me who got ripped out of $50 I ended up paying $200 for mine so yeah fuck you GameStop for that so I'm gonna get rid of it because Kinect is really nothing so this is what I call a reboxing so there is the Kinect back in its original packaging that I kept completely reboxed so when it comes down to it, Connect is not worth the 150 some dollars it is. Well, if you buy it with a Xbox or whatever, then maybe you might get a good deal, but besides that, it's not worth money at all. And on the other note, I'm going to do a quick review on the video game Crisis 2. And for any viewers who may not know me, I'm a pretty big gamer. And Crisis 2 is definitely worth the buy. So, on a scale from 1 to 10, it's probably a 9.5. No, it's not. It's probably like an 8.5. And, as of right now, I have nothing else to say except for... Oh, I'm kidding. Bye.